symbols, the numbers 7 and 2 come up time and time again. I hide the number 27 in every single one of my novels. And they were clearly special numbers to Leonardo. Da Vinci used 27 and 72 degrees as the basis for Vitruvian Man. The numbers show up repeatedly in his paintings, and he even invented his own shape that has 72 sides. When I found the number 72, I thought of the Last Supper. Because in the painting, the ceiling has 72 inlays. 7 and 2 also refers to John's gospel talking about the apocalypse. Clearly, da Vinci was fixated on 2 and 7. Silvano says 27 refers to the book of Revelations, in which Jesus tells Apostle John about a violent series of events at the end of the world. 72 is also a biblical reference. It refers to the number of races that survived Noah's Ark. That's right. The number 72 doesn't just relate to an apocalyptic story, but to a story describing a worldwide flood. Leonardo knew very well the Old and New Testament of the Bible, and in his library, personal library, he had these passages written out. So if we do look very closely at the Mona Lisa, do you think he's um, telling us something that's going to happen? Leonardo, Leonardo da Vinci used to say that the painting is the appearance that dresses the truth. If you look in the background of the painting, you'll see that the landscape is unfinished. Meanwhile, Mona Lisa is very clear, and it's saying that men have the power to destroy nature, so be careful. The genius of Leonardo is that he was able to put all that he learned inside his painting and put messages in there that speak to us over the ages. Silvano still has several tests to run before he can prove if Lisa Gerardini was...